thought we fought pretty hard. You know, we, this this season, you know, hasn't necessarily been what we wanted. I mean, in any in any, any way close to that. But tonight, I feel like we came together as a team and rallied behind Coach Lunny. And um, you know, losing losing is never acceptable. But uh, seeing the fight and everybody, especially for the seniors tonight, um, was really cool to see. He brought you guys in here yesterday. What what was that like? It was awesome. Um, he brought us in here at the stadium. We go watch the video, um, kind of a little hype video, kind of told us the history. And that's that's one thing he's done so well, you know, the past couple of weeks, is getting us back to the roots of being Razorback. You know, before last week we were at a we pulled up to the stadium, and before we went to LSU, and uh, he hopped out of the bus, stood on a bench in front of all of us. You know, no cameras, just just to kind of tell us the history about how we got our name. And, you know, I get chills thinking about, you know, how, how great of a job he did coming in because he is a true Razorback at heart. And me as been a, being a fan since I was a little kid, it just, it really was cool to see. And he rallied the troops. And I'm so proud of Coach. And, you know, I love that guy. What was it going to be like now? Everybody wants to know who the next head coach is going to be. Nobody's telling you guys. Just kind of what, what's that going to be like? You know, I went through uh, two coaching chains in high school, you know, came in with a new coach. You just got to buy in. No matter who it is, you got to buy in, give them, their, give them your best, because if you don't, you're part of the problem. You know, going in, just trying to, you know, buy into a, a culture and roll with it and give them, give them your all. I know you're on the other side of the ball. I said, I said Jack's today. I thought Jack Bald he did a great job, he gave us a spark. You know, throwing touchdown passes, and it was it was cool to see. How would you feel for Greg getting that pick after a long season, freshman, big moment for him? Yeah, it was huge. Uh, starting a, starting a half off that way is exactly what we wanted, and I just love excitement like that to start a second half off. What's it been like playing with Scooter, and how tough is it going to be not having him around? Yeah, I mean, it, it's it's one of those things where I'm you know not looking forward to not playing with him because he's been such a big big part of my progression as a linebacker. I just I know that he gave this university his all, and playing next to him was a, was such a pleasure. And I know he's going to do great things at the next level. How tough is it to carry the, the losing streak from the season and then the SEC losing streak into the off season? You guys obviously don't don't get to play again until next September. Yeah, I mean it's just go back to work mentality. You know, there's not there's not any quitting us, and you can't you got to what happened this past season put it in the rear view mirror. You know, it's still there, but you got to look forward. And you got to continue to work and continue to fight. How anxious are you about the new coach? 